नमस्ते माय डियर फ्रेंड्स न्यूज एटीन दे हैव कैरिड आउट ए वेरी वेरी बिग ओपिनियन पोल विद सैंपल साइज ऑफ मोर देन वन लैख एटीन थाउजेंड रेस्पोंडेंट्स अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस न्यूज एटीन ओपिनियन मेगा पोल बीजेपी लेड एन डी ए पॉइज फॉर हैट्रिक एंड मे विन फोर हंड्रेड इलेवन लोकसभा सीट्स द लास्ट टाइम ए पार्टी इन द कंट्री वॉन मोर देन फोर हंड्रेड सीट्स वॉज इन नाइनटीन एटी फोर आफ्टर द मर्डर ऑफ दि देन प्राइम मिनिस्टर इंदिरा गांधी द भारतीय जनता पार्टी बीजेपी लेड नेशनल डेमोक्रेटिक अलायंस एन डी ए इज ऑन कोर्स फॉर ए हैट्रिक ऑफ टर्म इन द अपकमिंग लोकसभा इलेक्शन टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी फोर अकॉर्डिंग टू द मेगा न्यूज एटीन ओपिनियन पोल रिजल्ट ऑन थर्सडे द सर्वे प्रोजेक्ट्स द बीजेपी लेड एन डी ए टू विन 411 Lok Sabha seats well over the 400 target prime minister Narendra Modi has set for the ruling alliance with the slogan ab ki baar 400 par the last time a part in the country won more than 400 seats was in 1984 when the congress party bagged 411 out of 400 542 at stake the nda vote share is expected to be at 48% in the upcoming general elections as per the poll nda 48% india block 32% others Twenty percent. New JT in opinion poll re- result for the upcoming Lok Sabha election 2024 with a 32 percent vote share. The Congress-led India Bloc is predicted to win 105 seats, better than the 91 seats it won its previous avatar as the. United Progressive Alliance (UPA) in 2018. Other parties are expected to win 27 seats as per the opinion poll. Within alliance, the BJP is set to improve its tally to 350 seats, while the other NDA partners will contribute 61 seats as per the poll. In the 2019 Lok Sabha elections, BJP won 303, while the NDA total was 353. So, as per the projection, BJP 350, other NDA partners 61, Congress 49, other Indi Bloc partners 56, others 27. The Congress will win 49 seats in the upcoming Lok Sabha polls, lower than its 2019 tally of 52 seats. Other India Bloc members will chip in with 56 seats. The opinion poll predicts that the BJP-led India will sweep the Hindi, Hindi heartland and Karnataka. it will also see a sharp rise in number in odisha west bengal telangana and andhra pradesh as per the results some of the states uttar pradesh nda 77 indi block 2 others 1 west bengal NDA 25, India Bloc 17, others 
तमिलनाडु एन डी ए फाइव इंडी ब्लॉक थर्टी अदर्स फोर मध्य प्रदेश एन डी ए ट्वेंटी एट इंडी ब्लॉक वन अदर्स जीरो कर्नाटका एन डी ए ट्वेंटी एट इंडी ब्लॉक वन अदर जीरो कर्नाटका एन डी एन डी ए ट्वेंटी फाइव इंडी ब्लॉक थ्री अदर जीरो गुजरात एन डी ए ट्वेंटी सिक्स इंडी ब्लॉक जीरो अदर जीरो महाराष्ट्र एन डी ए फोर्टी वन इंडी ब्लॉक सेवन अदर जीरो बिहार एन डी ए थर्टी एट इंडी ब्लॉक टू हरियाणा एन डी ए टेन इंडी ब्लॉक जीरो अदर्ज जीरो पंजाब एन डी ए थ्री अकाली दल वन कांग्रेस फाइव एंड आप पार्टी वन राजस्थान एन डी ए ट्वेंटी फाइव कांग्रेस जीरो छत्तीसगढ़ एन डी ए टेन इंडी ब्लॉक वन झारखंड एन डी ए ट्वेल्व इंडी ब्लॉक टू तेली एन डी ए सेवन इंडी ब्लॉक जीरो हिमाचल प्रदेश एन डी ए फोर इंडी ब्लॉक जीरो उत्तराखंड एन डी ए फाइव इंडी ब्लॉक जीरो सो ऑल टूगेदर एन डी ए फोर हंड्रेड इलेवन इंडी ब्लॉक वन हंड्रेड फाइव अदर जीरो नॉट जस्ट दैट द एन डी ए इज एक्सपेक्टेड टू सरप्राइज इन तमिलनाडु एंड केरला द टू स्टेट्स वेयर इट इज वर्किंग ओवर टाइम टू मेक इट्स प्रेजेंस फेल्ट ऑन द अदर हैंड द हाइएस्ट नंबर ऑफ सीट्स द इंडी अलायंस इज गोइंग टू गार्नर इज फ्रॉम वेस्ट बंगाल एंड तमिलनाडु टू स्टेट्स वेयर स्ट्रॉन्ग रीजनल पार्टीज एग्जिस्ट इन द फॉर्म ऑफ ममता बैनर्जी लेड तृणमूल कांग्रेस एंड द डी एम के एन एक्सटेंसिव सर्वे कवरिंग फाइव हंड्रेड एटीन लोकसभा कॉन्स्टिट्युएंसीज अक्रॉस ट्वेंटी वन मेजर स्टेट्स द न्यूज एटीन ओपिनियन पोल फीचर जे मासिव सिंपल साइज ऑफ ओवर वन लैख एटीन थाउजेंड सिक्स हंड्रेड सिक्सटीन रेस्पोंडेंट्स रिप्रेजेंटिंग नाइंटी फाइव परसेंट ऑफ द लोकसभा कंस्टिट्युएंसीज एंड मेकिंग इट वन ऑफ द लार्जेस्ट सर्वे इन द कंट्री द न्यूज एटीन मेगा ओपिनियन पोल वॉज कंडक्टेड बाई न्यूज एटीन पोल हब सी द वीडियो क्लिप क्विकली टू आर व्यूअर्स न्यूज एटीन मेगा ओपिनियन पोल दिस इज द ब्रेकअप टू टू पृथ्वीराज चौहान जी क्लाइड क्रास्टो कामरू चौधरी स्पोकन विल कम टू एम नाउ 350 to the BJP. The allies get 61 seats. The Congress, short of 50 seats. The Congress is at 49, and the allies of the Congress, allies in the Indian alliance, the smaller parties, perhaps some of the regional chakrabs, gain more. They collectively have 56 seats.
seats compared to the National Party that is Congress Party at 49. The INDI Alliance overall 105. The NDA 411. Pratiraj I know you have to leave. He's, he's, he's not there. He's left already. Yes, Kambu Chaudhary. Your thoughts. And then I'll bring in Clyde Castro again. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we all heard my leader, Pratiraj He gave a very, very good description of the entire Indian poll that you are running on national television. But since I have joined late and I have seen the Maharashtra opinion poll, let me just point out a few facts out here. 2019, BJP is polled around 27%, Shiv Sena around 23 NCP around 15 and Congress around 16%. Now, what does this suggest that the BJP is going to up to around, or the, or the, or the alliance of the BJP is going up to 41% and Congress and the alliance is going up to 33%. What necessarily you have done is you have split the Shiv Sena and the NCP votes and added that with the BJP votes. But the ground reality is absolutely different as my leader Prithviraj Ji has just now shown. Because Shinde is, a, is go, going to be a discard after this election. Ajit Pawar will also be a discard after this election lies Chautala was in Haryana. So what happens here is that my reports from the ground suggest that the Shiv Sena votes will be split around on a 70-30 basis. The NCP votes led by Ajit Power Group will be split on a 70-30 votes. The Mahavika Sagadi out here stands a chance to reach up to 40 So his argument 40 is that part. Ajit, pa Ajit Pawar match, will get 30% because of the split. So so 30%. If the maths was no, so deterministic, yes. one, one second. Then in 2019, there was a state called Uttar Pradesh, which saw, since the word is being used, an unnatural alliance. The SP, the BSP, and the RLD all coming together. But there was no chemistry. As a result of which, they ended up with somewhere around 20% or 22% of the vote. Rahul, so Rahul. maths is not deterministic, sir. It is no, no, chemistry. No, no, no. Let, me, let me just be, be logical in your questioning, sir. Let me just explain what happened in Uttar Pradesh vis a vis So, maths is all about logic. Coming, coming to the point, sir, the basic what happened in Uttar Pradesh was a reverse polarization. Same way what happened in West Bengal in 2021 assembly election. So, don't bank on the entire thing that the entire country is after Modi ji and Bhatia Janta party. There is a very, accept it or not. There, no, is a there is no denying it. The there is a 35% vote that has gone to the opposition. 48% no, no. yeah, yeah, has gone to the NDA. There is a 35% vote that has gone to the opposition and it still remains. But I'm the not, fact is, sir, that 35% has remained a constant. It's not gone up. Clyde Crasto quickly and then we'll get you an update on Mamta Banerjee also. Yes, Clyde Crasto. Anand, hear me out. Anand, I mean, I, I've been watching your numbers. I'm seeing them. Fair enough. Yeah. You've done your uh, homework and you're doing all the exercise and everything. Fair enough. But the fact of the matter is the ground reality is very different and you know I am connected to the ground. Hmm. Let me tell you one thing, the ground shows something different. I am not taking anything away from the numbers that you are giving for the BJP. But here we are discussing Ajit Pawar, we are discussing Iknath Shinde. Believe me, the ground reality about these two groups are completely different. My friend Shahzad, whom I always have a healthy banter with, you know, he gave an example of uh, uh, Sanjay Nirupam and Sanjay Raut and where. If you start talking about this, there are so many people in the BJP who are upset. There are people who are leaving the BJP going to the Congress. We had Mr. Nilesh Lanke, who is now left the Ajit Pawar group and is coming back uh, to our group. So these things are going to happen. I just feel, see, Shahzad and I can keep going. He can you know, give examples. I can give examples. In the aftermath. But the point here is very simple. Mr. I think Krasno, it's a little too early to get to numbers. I don't want to, yes. you know, let's not constantly only sort of obsess about one state now that we have the whole picture. picture. Just one quick point, though. Uh, it's funny that we are constantly now nitpicking mm. when it's quite clear that this particular election is happening and I'm not saying that you know all results mirror but there is a trend the Congress threw the kitchen sink at the Hindi belt where you had three significant states just in December and in the lead up to that in November before that you had Mr. Rahul Gandhi embarking on a Bharat Joro Yatra and uh, what were the trends there? The BJP won three. Even in Telangana, it's done better. And in Mizoram, it opened its account by two, where even Christian candidates won. What does it tell you? It's carrying simply more people. More people are willing to trust it. 
Can I That's the ground like, reality. Can mm. I just add one line to this? I completely agree with what Rahul is saying. And what these people are missing is forget the numbers. They are missing that the template of politics has changed. They are trapped in the 1980s and 90s politics. OBC, caste reservation, North, South. The, these the, are not the issues. The, the, the issues of today, just 10 seconds, yeah. Anand. The issues of today is that where is this country going as far as foreign policy is concerned? Where is it going as far as Garibi Hatao is concerned? Where is it going as far as taking the economies forward is concerned? And there is only one person talking about that, one party that's talking about and giving a vision. You can criticize us on our vision. You can say, why is it number five right now? Why is it number four? But instead of doing that, what they're saying is, I am talking about GST, mein kitna OBC, kitna See, I'll tell you what, no, this I, is, no, no, there is a, there is a point of... It's not about OBC because that's why Khattar, Khattar was replaced. Yeah. No, Anand, uh, I'll tell you about that. As far as Saini is concerned, the party is very clear that this party is going to also give space to a lot of its karikartas. They, today, we, I am proud of the fact that there are a lot of 45 to 55 year olds who are now becoming the second generation leaders. Whether it's Hemanta Viswa Sarma, whether it's Yogi Adityanath Ji, whether it's Home Minister Amit Shah Ji, who is in that same age bracket, whether it's Devendra Fadnavis Ji, who is the deputy CM, whether it's a younger lot, we in our party no, has a constant they, system where we are younger they, people are also coming up. The, despite the, big nobody victories, is on they also replaced for, uh, Shivraj Chauhan. They also said that they look beyond Masundra Raji. So there you have to say that there is a certain understanding and learning that unless you promote the Karakartas and the next generation, five years, ten years down the line, you're not. There is a party with a plan. That is that's one aspect. But with respect to Maharashtra, BMC elections have been pushed. The the state assembly elections are going to come in October. Somewhere one gets the feeling that by having two DCMs, one CM, they are showing that this UT can work. Because they are the three people. If these three can work together, then perhaps the UT will work together on ground and some success in the Lok Sabha will translate into gains in the assembly election. So, this is a retrofit happening. If Lok Sabha will be good, then we will be able to get our own money. So, all is not well for the BJP also. Please understand that. And you have had big reversals also, sir. You have had big reversals in Karnataka. You have not got it right. Five years of Kerala and these two seats that you are projecting, that's also a surprise. Five years in Kerala. First place the Prime Minister went to after winning 2019 was Guruvayur. And you still don't have the confidence to win two seats in Kerala. Uh, so, and there are 20 big states. There are 20 big states. Tamil Nadu, Anna Malaya and the legwork that he is doing, still not sure if you will win five. Still uh, not look, sure if you will win five. Anand, so, I am saying, now, sir, now let me speak 10 seconds to counter where that. You need, where, where you need to do a lot of legwork. We acknowledge that. Anand, who in their right mind would have said that two times you will form government in Tripura? Who in their right mind would have said that we would have 10 years ago formed government in Haryana twice? Who in their right mind would have said that we would have formed government twice in Assam? Who in their right mind would have said from 2 to 18 we will go in uh, Bengal and today we are going to be the number one party? Who in their right mind would have said we will be the largest party in Odisha? Hmm. Five ten years ago, so hmm. you can taunt us that Kerala mein abhi bhi do seat mushkil hai, Tamil Nadu mein teen seat mushkil hai. But we are a party that never leaves one inch of this country. We take every place seriously. We take corporation elections seriously. We take Lok Sabha elections seriously. We give it our best shot.